what's it like being down here in Mobile so far? Um, it's great. It's a lot of opportunities. You get to see a lot of other great athletes. I'm just ready to look to compete. And small school kid, um, a little chip on your shoulder, something to prove this week? Oh, of course. Um, you know, I'm coming from a small school. I mean, everybody's looking at you didn't compete against the best, but um, I'm looking to prove that I can compete with the best and continue to do it. Definitely. And wh- what do you think got you here? What are those traits of the game that these scouts, you know, noticed and really fell in love with? Just being just being physical at the position, you know, really standing my ground. Don't, don't let anybody uh, bully me out there and really uh, take it to the opponent. And I do that every single game, in and out, and just play fast. Nice. And wh- wh- how did you kind of find yourself playing that position? Um, actually, I mean, I never played uh, corner until I got to college. So, really? Uh, it really was a, a transitional uh, period. But, I mean, I had a great uh, corner to look up to, uh, Jeremy Lane. He's the starting nickel for the um, the Seattle Seahawks. So, I mean, I had a great corner to look up to, to learn a lot from. And um, it just, my game took off from there. Did you text him yesterday? Congratulations. Oh, yeah. What do you have to say? Oh, he said, uh, thank you. I mean, <laughs> like That's like a big brother to me, man. Nice, nice. So somebody you can lean on. Oh, most process. definitely. I talk to him and everything about the whole agent process, scouting process, and everything. He's he's been a good hand to reach out to. Excellent. So I don't know if you'd say this. Uh, if we compared you to a guy at the next level, would you say him, or is there somebody else that you might remind us of? I mean, all the scouts compare me to him. So hey, y'all can too. <laughs> so uh, Jeremy Lane, part two. Oh yeah. Yeah, it's, it's awesome stuff. And uh, the impact that you make down here this week. I mean, uh, is there any misconceptions about your game? Um, I, I wouldn't say there's any misconceptions. You know, I just look to come down here and just learn from the coaches that's out there because they're NFL coaches. So anything they say, I just wanted to stick and um, be able to translate that into my game and make it even better. Big film junkie? Oh, yeah. Watch film. I'm up there with the coaches. Nice. This is, I, this is one of my favorite questions to ask because I love going inside the game. Um, is there a play or anything you can think of on a Saturday where – you know, you watch game film all week long, and uh-huh. then it comes to fruition, you make a big play? Yeah, we're at FCS school, and we beat uh, Louisiana Tech, and they're at FBS school, so we had an upset on them. And um, they down to the two-minute warning, they ran um, – they run the bench concept, and they only run that bench concept to the boundary. I'm the boundary corner. Um, so it was two minutes ago. They tried to get out of bounds because, obviously, you have to get out of bounds fast. So we're in cover two, and I knew it was coming. Um, so I jammed my receiver inside. I dropped back. Um, reached up and um, tipped the ball. Our safety pick it, uh, picked it, and we um, kicked the game-winning field goal to win the football game. 